So, okay, great. <laughs> Let's make a start. So, so Bharat Yatra in 2024, uh, just we, we just did the introductions. Uh, in total, we have uh, 16 Yatris in total, and um, out of whom fifth, 11 of you, them, 11 of you will be coming for the full four weeks. So after two weeks, five um, devotees return back to the UK. Uh, we've booked all the air tickets. These are the international and the internal, internal flights. Yeah, oh, good. Yeah, you can just <laughs> share them. So uh, with the international airlines, um, um, how many were there? Ten are going by Air India on the 5th of August. Two going by Virgin. The reason being Air India became extremely expensive. It was like 1,500, 1,600 pounds for an economy ticket. So we decided to, um, that was just too much uh, costing wise. So two, and that is Pat and my sister, they're coming by Virgin Airlines. Yeah. We, uh, yeah, oh yeah, if there's any questions or any comments, you're welcome to, in, you know, interrupt us. as we're going along. You just ask, um, don't need to put your hand up, just uh, unmute and ask. Huh? Uh, to and fro from the airport, uh, we haven't made any arrangements, but we can. Um, I think uh, Bharti Ben is Norbury, Pat is in Norbury. Pat is a different time. We are, oh, Pat is earlier, yeah. Pat is earlier. Uh, so we can work that out and um, see what how to do that. So... But we have made that arrangement, uh, either going to the airport or coming back from the airport to your home. If anybody wants any any wheelchair, uh, please do let us know because we haven't ordered any for anybody. Um, we have ordered Jane meals. That Jane meals basically means uh, sattvic meal, meal meals without uh, onion garlic. And ideally, when we do yatra. Um, we want to try to maintain a sattvic uh, diet, um, so which uh, means no feet, no no fish, no meat, no, no fish, no eggs, of course, but also no onion, no garlic, if possible. So, if, if anybody really objects to that, just let me know. Uh, it's, it's you know not a big big issue, but um, it's just when you're doing a spiritual yatra, it's just uh, and it's very 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 easy. Um, you won't even miss the onion and garlic if you if you eat it at the moment. Internal flights, um, as uh, Kalpana Ben said, there's a limit in terms of the luggage that you can take. So 15 kgs uh, and seven kgs by hand, 15 through the um, through their uh, haulage. Now we when we go, we are allowed. 46 kgs. So what we have done, some people have clothes, old clothes that they want to take with them and leave in, in Bharat. So what we can do is we can, if anybody wants to do that, bring an extra suitcase with you and we will get, we will ask um, our, our uh, wonderful devotees in Vrindavan to come and pick them up from us from the airport, at the airport. So if you want to take an extra suitcase, and that suitcase will be available back to you at the end uh, if you're coming to Vrindavan. Uh, if you're not coming to Vrindavan, then uh, that suitcase will be uh, left in India. If you don't, as a, So if you don't want it, that's fine. And if you do want that suitcase, uh, if, if you're one of the five who are coming back early, if you want the suitcase, we can always bring it back with us when we come back to the UK. So if anybody's got any extra luggage, any, um, sorry, old clothes, anything they want to give away, uh, you're welcome to bring them and pack them separately 
uh, so that the suitcase can just go to Vrindavan. Any questions at this point? An internal flight from Delhi to Ayodhya actually is Air India Express for everyone. Uh, travel, some of the travel is by train, uh, especially the long journeys, only two long journeys, Gaya to Kolkata and Udaipur to Mathura. Both of these journeys are extra, uh, like uh, more than 12 hours. So doing it by car is going to be uh, quite a challenge, uh, quite uncomfortable. So overnight trains are um, pretty comfortable. We book... Um, Second class, uh, sorry, uh, two AC, two tier AC, two tier AC. So they're air conditioned, and they're too tired. So which means that there's like a bunk bed, <laughs> and there's usually four in a cabin, and uh, they provide <gasps> the bedding, cushion, blanket, um, and their overnight journey. So. I think the Gaia one might be a little late. It might be about 11 o'clock when it gets to Kolkata at 8. And Udaipur, I think, is at 6.30, mm -hmm. which gets to Mathura at about 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. But they, they are very comfortable journeys. And if anybody is... Um, we'll try to get all the lower bunks, lower berths. Um, but if there is an upper berth and it's uh, hard to manage, we can... Uh, probably make a suitable arrangement to have the lower berth. So don't worry about um, having to climb up into the upper berth. I mean, the trains are yet to be booked. Uh, I'll have a look mm -hmm. next week because they only open up three months before the actual travel date. Okay, any questions up to now? The rest okay. of the travel we're going to do by um, a minivan. It's uh, called a traveler in in uh, Bharat. They're really very comfortable. We did, we took a mini minivan, minibus uh, in yeah. south yeah. for about eleven days uh, last year, and my goodness, it was so good. So for for the journey in the north in the north from Ayodhya to Gaya. We will have a 26-seater, although there's only 16 of us uh, or at the moment. There might be a couple more, but at the moment, six, 20, 16 of us. So 26-seater, it gives us a little extra space so we can uh, spread out a little bit. We're not squashed in. And uh, on the second, the second part of the journey, there will be 11. Oh, yeah, so that's Ayodhya to Gaya, six days in the Traveller. And then from Jaipur to Daipur um, and all the other places in between Nathwar and um, Pushkar. Pushkar. Um, That's a total of three, three days. days. So we'll have about 11, La. 11 days. Uh, oh, yeah. This. Okay. okay. Hotels, um, more or less all booked, except for Mayapur. They don't allow booking until two months before the journey. And in that, uh, Mayapur is the Hare Krishna temple there. Very, very opulent, very beautiful. They have uh, quite large rooms. They're pretty much four-star category. Um, it's four people in a room, but it's quite a... It's quite a big room. It's like uh, if you have a, a double room in your house, a double living doubles. room, it's like, mm -hmm. uh, it's like a double, uh, two, two double rooms. Yeah. Um, so they, they're not cheap. They're quite expensive. Um, so we will try to, uh, we will try to make the arrangement so that people who are, you know, friends are together um, like that. So, um, but not, uh, I think um, Pat and my sister, for example, will share one room. Um, and we'll have Nani Ben, um, Arti Ben, and Kaushalya in one, hopefully. And then the others are a little bit more straightforward. I think uh, 
Rajesh and uh, Premika and us are together, right? Something like that. So we'll work it out so that it's comfortable for everybody. Oh, Pitamba is with us. So yeah. Anyway, we'll work it out so that it's comfortable for everybody. If anybody has an Aadhaar card, that is always very handy. Uh, we don't have one. Um, but if anybody does, maybe uh, Kalpna Ben, um, then if you can bring that card with you so that, especially when it comes to hotels, it just saves a lot of registration later yeah, on. Yeah, otherwise, if it, we don't have an Aadhaar card between us, uh, everyone has to give in their passports and fill in their, all the forms. So it just makes it a little easier for everyone. Yeah, sure. We will produce our Aadhaar card. Brilliant. Ah, Brilliant. Very good. Excellent. That's, that will help a lot mm. because it just saves a lot of time as well. Yeah, then no one else, only just yourself will have to fill in the form. And we'll do that yeah. for you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we can do Thank that you for that. How do you get? Excuse me. How do you get this card? You have to. Be, we we have a we have a property in Delhi. Yeah. Uh, it's for the Indians. Yeah, yes. you have to have a residence no. in, in in Bharat to be able to apply for that. Uh, no, no, that's not okay. necessary these days because okay. many NRIs also own properties in Delhi or in other places. Hmm. 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 But um, yeah, yeah, it's, that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's right. It's not easy to get. Um, yeah, I mean, we've tried. <laughs> we've really no, haven't we haven't really tried. tried. We will. Uh, we'll yeah. get it one day. Travel insurance. Uh, we. Uh, I think everybody will be getting their tra travel insurance. We do uh, insist that everybody has travel insurance because you just don't know what can happen, and it's better safe than sorry. Um, so please, please get travel insurance. And because we've already booked the tickets as well, uh, you should have your travel insurance uh, already in place. Because um, if, if if some illness comes uh, or something happens, God forbid, then at least you are covered, you know? So. Yeah, because we just uh, heard like a family, a uh, couple mm. who went to Bharat, they went to uh, Raj area, Yodhi, all those places, and the, the wife uh, got a virus, and she was in hospital in Gujarat for about eight days, and even now she, you know, it was difficult uh, traveling back as well on the plane, and so you know, expenses can mount up even in Bharat uh, if you don't have insurance. Hmm. This situation was a little different mm -hmm. um, because when they showed us the itinerary, how they were going, I was thinking, impossible. You cannot do so many things in two weeks. In two weeks. <laughs> they were going to uh, Vrindavan and many places within Vrindavan. They were going to Ayodhya, uh, Baroda, Ahmedabad, and Ooh. quite big distances, you know? Yeah, I mean, like draw our car journeys. and Three of them. <laughs> And the hotels were really uh, substandard. Like, like Dharam Shalas. Yeah, substandard. Mm. So they got, a lot of the party got ill. And and I was, mm. I was a little surprised that they were packing in so much. And we're packing in a lot. But at the same time, um, uh, we, we're making provision that this, the comfort is there. And also... The hygiene um, and cleanliness is there, you know. So I think there were there were some shortcomings in what they were doing. So uh, visas, I think uh, Bharti Ben, you need a visa. Hat need a visa, and Rajesh and uh, Pemika. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, I think uh, visas you can apply for, is it three months before? In in, in the UK. I'm not sure about South Africa. You'll have to check that. Okay. Three months. Three months as three well. Months. Okay. okay. So yeah. you will need an address. So we will provide you the address and phone, local phone number. Um, you can put mm -hmm. that on the application. And and also, I think Deepa, Deepa also needs to apply. So, yes, yeah. Deepa needs to uh, mm. apply. So there's quite a few of us. And any any help that is needed, 
let us know because we will uh, assist you in that process. Yeah, just put a message on the group whenever if you need any any mm. assistance. Uh, medications, of course, you know, you will uh, bring your medications that you need. Um, and uh, please bring enough so that you have, if you're coming for two weeks, there's enough for two weeks. If they're coming for four weeks, it's enough for four weeks. Um, insect repellent, it's advisable to just take at least one bottle from here. Uh, afterwards, we can easily buy there. They have some very good uh, rep insect repellents there, but we may may not get time initially to buy. So it's just good to carry some uh, mosquito repellent or something. Vaccinations, always good to take uh, beforehand. It's good precautions, typhoid, the, the three in one, including the tetanus, hepatitis mm -hmm. A, uh, just if you make sure you are either up to date or if you have to take um, take it if you if you want to if you don't then um, you know it, it is it is a personal choice mm -hmm. of course we we won't force anybody to take the vaccinations because mm -hmm. um, we know so vaccinations may may sometimes make things worse for the individual so. Uh, and not even any advice here. I think that that's okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think um, we need only take I... alcohol gel, isn't it? Because of the uh, just for for safety for ourselves. Sorry, what what uh, is alcohol, it? alcohol gel? Alcohol gel that we usually use. Oh, for... the sanitizer. Yeah. Yeah. But they have, medication like pain in the they have non alcoholic as well, yeah. Mm. But uh, again, um, I'm going to um, just send a, a little list out later in, in the group, and that has uh, th those sort of um, items on it you know, things like wipes and you know, things like that, which uh, which is uh, useful to, to take. Can I just say that, um, yes. What about um, because it's a rainy season? Mm. I was I was advised by the nurse because I looked into the vaccination. Mm. And they said uh, malaria, malaria mm -hmm. tablets because it's uh, basically mm. you know we're going at a time when it's rainy or or yeah. just about finishing off. So that's when you have the mm. Mm. most Mosquito. likely you know, yeah. malaria issues. Yeah. Again, that's a personal choice. Um, if, like, uh, we we don't take it. We we because we go every year around this time. We found that you know, uh, there's not that many mosquitoes. Um, mm. I mean, like last year, I don't think uh, anyone was really uh, had any. Yeah, had had he had any problems. Uh, and I don't think anyone in the group. I mean, Pritanda, did you take any malaria tablets? Hare Krishna, Mataji. I took um, none. I did take them with me. Yeah. Uh, and um, I did get bit a few times. Yeah. If you just ignore the bite, um, within a day or two, you're fine. So mm -hmm. yeah. And I never, I never saw as much mosquitoes as mm -hmm. when I did when I was little and I went during the hot period. Correct. Yeah, that's what we've found. But again, mm -hmm. it's a personal choice. Mm. Uh, and and even what would you advise? Uh, she's our doctor on the, uh, so we yeah. go to her. I, I would say personal choice. Yeah. We, would have, we didn't take any last year. Yeah. Because and we went in August as well. Correct. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So not that many mosquitoes there. No. Yeah, and the year before as well, we went went, went in August. So. Yeah. So what we do also is if we go out late, um, we put the mosquito repellent on our uh, body. Uh, mm -hmm. legs, you know, um, uh, shoulder, yeah. you know, shoulders, neck and all that, face. Yes, yeah. And also, you know, um, they also advise that if, if we get this spray, which we can oh, get in Bharat yeah. as well, yeah. even in your clothes, because, you know, if even if you have long sleeves, yeah. uh, they can still uh, bite through the your uh, clothing. So, you know, when you, if you're going out at night, we just uh, spray, uh, you know, uh, sleeves and things like that. So that helps as well. So we we found uh, 
you know the uh, repellents more um, useful than than taking the malaria tablets. But malaria tablets also, you know, it can upset your stomach as well. So again, as I said, it's a personal choice. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. We were spraying on the clothes all the time, isn't it, Mother? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It should be okay. Uh, yeah. I, I don't think uh, I don't think anybody's in our trips. We've been very fortunate. Maybe a little cold or, or a sore throat, but other than that, um, no no stomach aches, no stomach bugs. No, I mean once we took a uh, group of fifty and we didn't have any issues either. Apart so, from cold yeah. and uh, yeah. cough. Yeah, cold and cough. Mm -hmm. Uh, is is a potential. Yeah, because we're very careful where we eat as well and things like that. So again, you know. Not many people have had issues with diarrhea and things like that and food poisoning. Mm. So if, if there's nothing else there, keep belonging safe. Again, this 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 couple who went, uh, I think the second day, um, mm. his uh, mobile phone went missing. And I've had my mobile phone stolen a couple of times, actually. So... Um, Maybe just think about the security of your valued possessions, the passport, uh, money we'll talk about a bit later, uh, credit cards, if, if you're taking any phone. Just think about um, making sure they're secure. Yeah, especially when you're going into a crowded place. Yeah. That's that's where usually these things yeah. Are, happen. Yeah. So that's... Um, it's everywhere. I mean, pick, it's not just India. This mm. is uh, even in the UK. We have to be careful. But when you're traveling and you got so many other things going on at the same time, it's really easy for people to um, take advantage of that. Oh yes. So locks. Uh, you should have locks on all the bags, uh, including the hand luggage, and you should also we should also keep all of our lock uh, bags locked at all times even in hotels. Um, so this is just a precaution that is best to take. We may even possibly leave our suitcases, if they're safe, in, uh, in, the, in the van itself, in the, in the uh, yeah. traveler when we're traveling. Uh, but that we will, because to take everything out and then put it back for one night uh, might be quite a, quite a task. So again, just your bags, perhaps if they're waterproof or, you know, quite good solid bags, that helps. Uh, last year we had an incident where the bags were on the top, but the rain came and the rain got into some of the bags and we had to, you know, it was, it was a bit of painful. Yeah, uh, even though, they, you know, that uh, plastic really. cover on it, because it rained so much, mm. I went through and... Uh, mm. Some of the clothes, uh, it went and the rain went into the bags as well. But mm. and Pitam has made a very good point bags with wheels, <laughs> indeed, very, very important. And luckily, there's only two trains, uh, so we're only dealing with um, four lots of coolies. <laughs> the coolies have a very good time with us, uh, they uh, they rip us off <laughs> big time. <laughs> <laughs> because they see so many of us, so many suitcases. They, oh, they, they just see uh, money. They, they know we're uh, we're outsiders. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's good. Good point. Thank you. Are we are we are we saying that um, if you have the bag with the wheels, could you roll it yourself, or do you have to give it to the coolies? I mean, no, no, no you no, can no. roll it. You can no. take it yourself. Yeah. Um, but you know, I my preference is. We take the coolies because you know we got so many things going on. It's a, it's a it's a it's a busy schedule. It's but luck, tiring. Luckily, it's only uh, two yeah. trains. But so. but in yeah. any case, we we even if you got wheels, we'll still take coolies because okay. you know, there's quite a few of us who are, who are not so young anymore. So mm -hmm. rather safe than sorry. Okay, and do we have a certain size bag that we mm -hmm. are? you would recommend we should take because no, it's only I mean, it's only 15 cages i mean you can have a big bag with only 15 cages in there it's up to you it's up to you having said that it doesn't cost i will check this out but it doesn't cost so much if you have excess baggage um it's i think it's about 300 or 400 rupees 
per kilo, three or four or five pounds per kilo, which is not a huge amount of money. Uh, and also when we're going in a big group, usually we can get away with a bit more weight mm -hmm. anyway. Uh, although that's a bit of a risk. <laughs> Ideally, if, if you can travel light, it will help everyone. It'll help yourself as yeah. well. Yeah, yeah, true. <laughs> Raincoats. Ah. Yeah, that's part of the list that I'm going to send out. Yes, good, oh. good. <laughs> Thank you, Naniven. Good point. Good point. Okay. Uh, dietary requirements, allergies. One person has already mentioned. Um, that uh, they 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 have issues with certain types of foods or spices. Uh, if you do have, let us know early, um, because when we go to the hotels or the restaurants, we can make sure uh, that you know everything is safe for you. Mm -hmm. And as I was saying earlier, sattvic diet on on the yatra, no onion, no garlic. Uh, mm -hmm. Most places we go to, we can get everything we want. Um, Mm, so it's, it's not going to be an issue. Have snacks uh, with you, and we will also get some fruits, you know, for journeys, so that uh, you know there's uh, and and some some snacks as well. Uh, um, but if you if you need snacks in between meals, just have some for yourselves at least. But we will get some anyway. And anything else? Um, ah, yeah, sorry. Money-wise, um, we would actually say don't bring any sterling. Don't bring any cash. If you've got rupees with you, bring those. Spend them. If you want rupees, we can give you rupees. We get quite a good rate, uh, exchange rate. At the moment, I think the official is 104.5, but we get 106 from Axis. So we will get a really good rate. So you will, you know, there will be things for you if you want to buy, if you want to make some donations. We're happy to, um, you know, you can give us sterling, uh, not here. I mean, not there. Just put it straight into the bank account, and uh, we will give you the rupees, and we'll keep an account of what we've get, what you've given us, and what we will give you. So if you want to spend money in Bharat, uh, and I think you should probably spend uh, as a minimum guide, I would say probably a hundred pounds. Uh, maybe you want to buy some things for your uh, you know, family, grandchildren, or if you want to make some donations anywhere, the Ram Mandir, for example, um, you can do that, but we can provide you the rupees when we get there. So are you are we saying hundred pounds for the whole month? It's the same minimum. That's minimum. You can. I mean, we will probably between me no, it's, and Jainty. It, it's up to you. Yeah. Up to you. But um, Be, me, between I mean, me and Jainty, as a guide, about a thousand pounds we will be sort of spending for shopping for the mandir and uh, for donations. donations. It's completely up to you. I would say as a minimum, probably have a hundred. And and if you don't spend the rupees, you can give them back to us at the end, and we'll give you the sterling back. Okay, so we we would get sterling um, cash sterling. No, that means we be carrying quite a bit, won't we? No, no, you don't so carry anything. No, ca don't carry any cash. Like we, initially, we, 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 initially, yeah. like before we go, you say, okay, I um, can you give us a hundred pounds of rupees when we get there, and you put hundred pounds into the account. Before we go, yeah. So there, we'll give you the hundred pounds of rupees, and if you don't use those, you can give the rupees back to us, and we'll give them the uh, change back. Oh, okay. So you give us the cash when we get there. Yeah, the rupees. The rupees, yeah. Cash, rupees in cash. When yeah. once we get there, yeah. So at least we don't have the liability of carrying it. Correct. Us. Correct. Such. And also there, you know, if, if you don't want it on day one, uh, you know, you just tell us and we'll give it to you as you want it. So, you, you know, you, you don't have to, because what we'll what? do, we just uh, take it out of the, of the ATM as and when we need it as well. So we're not also carrying around a lot of cash. Yeah, no cash. Oh, mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. a, that's a relief because that was a bit of a, a worry. Yeah. 
how yeah. to carry it or don't don't take any sterling yeah and maybe for the airport if you want some coffee or something fair enough but five pounds ten pounds but no but, more yeah or just your card you know your credit card your credit card yeah true true have your phone with you uh oh yeah we'll talk about that in a minute so that's the rupees uh travel light we've gone through that list of things to take Jenti will make a list and send it oh, we, we, hot spot is we available got where, we got where it was. We got where, again oh, let me just uh it's okay right. so um hot spot will be available we've got um three phones with is it two for two, two phones, phones with um added sims? In, in the... So hotspot yeah. available uh, as long as you are near where we are. So that's that's. No. So basically, you you'll be able to use WhatsApp uh, on on your um on your uh, personal phones uh, by linking onto a, the hotspot on our phones. You mean you mean we can use our English? Yeah. Language? Yes. Yes. Uh, and WhatsApp. I mean, uh, our yeah. phone. Yeah, yeah. Your English phone. You can use it there. But basically, you you just link onto um this you know a hotspot um on our uh sim, and you can use your WhatsApp. So you can bring your phone if you want to. Yeah. But of course, be very careful. It doesn't uh, get mislaid. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's uh, that's handy to know. Yeah, um, yeah. Are we? Yeah, are we always? I mean, I know there might not be always the case, but are we mostly going to be together anyway? In the yeah. sense, the whole group. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I think okay. uh, we've got handcuffs so that uh, <laughs> <laughs> nobody, nobody gets lost. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> He Is it have to possible? Have to have <laughs> <laughs> Is it possible to have the name, the list of hotels will be list of what hotels? Hotels. Hotel. Uh, we yes. can, yeah, we can. In 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 time, once we've uh, sorted out the daily schedule, we'll have that on that list yes. anyway. Yeah. So Jenti okay. will produce a very detailed schedule of what we're doing day by day, what time we're having breakfast. <laughs> what time we leave on one place to go to another, you know, the time, yeah. number of uh, hours uh, in the traveler, things like that. So it will be a detailed yeah. list. It's not so, we're, we're very strict. Uh, you know, if you're late by one minute, you miss the bus. <laughs> but, um, you know, if we have an idea and everybody is... Uh, you know, in good health and uh, fit, we'll make a move. So, and if, say, somebody wants to say, oh, you know, yesterday was really hard. I'm going to just take it easy this morning. That's fine as well. Um, uh, and then we can make some arrangement as to uh, when to meet again. Either we meet back at the hotel or sometimes some devotees uh, if they're feeling a little tired, uh, because some of the journeys can be tiring, um, that you know that flexibility is there. Mm -hmm. Ideally, however, we'd want to be together uh, at all times. You know, when we're going out to the for the darshans and uh, whatever else is going on. Any questions? Uh, any? Anything that uh... Uh, will, yeah, will there be any guide? Uh, any guide? To tell about the places. Yeah, uh, where we are unfamiliar, like Ayodhya, for example, we will take. We will um, have a guide. Right. Get the guides, yeah, to help us through. Yes, absolutely. Um, yeah. That's fine. Because sometimes even drivers know a lot about the places. Yes. And they are yeah. very good guys. Yes. You're right. Right. yes. Actually, you're right. Last time when we went to mm. South, we had a fantastic mm. driver. 
and he would come with us everywhere help us uh, yeah some of us were a little slow right he would help all of us and he would know a lot about what's going on mm. so that was useful <laughs> yes we'll take advantage mm -hmm. of uh, and if if on the trip you know you feel that hang on we could do this better or yeah. that, you know that that feedback is always good yeah and and we we will probably need some idea about how much tip to offer to drivers and porters no no that's all included <clears throat> that's all included okay all, you don't have to worry at all about that that's right for my negotiations with the taxi people and it, they're not cheap they are really quite expensive now i'm surprised how expensive it is but mm -hmm. i am putting that all into the package right okay the, so there's right. no surprises at the end you know the yeah. driver can't turn around and say you owe us you know 30 right. rupees or something like that yeah 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 okay thank you for you the only expenditure really is yeah. The uh, donations, the shopping. Yeah. Sometimes in the south, they would yeah. have this VIP yeah. version, you know, like five hundred yes, yes. rupees. Yeah. I mean, we yeah. can. We don't mind. I don't mind. Um, like uh, providing uh hundred pound, hundred rupees, two hundred rupees for VIP. But when it gets to like five hundred thousand rupees, I think no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that we yeah. can't afford. And if somebody mm -hmm. wants to do that then that can be done, but that will be to be paid separately, you know? Right. But I don't think yeah. even in Ayodhya, I've asked yeah. uh, the people there, they don't mm. have the VIP darshan, which is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I know that. No yeah. VIP darshans at all. Yeah, which is good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. what, um, what do you do about the, um, the fact that we are going to be on the move all the time or most of the time? How about washing the clothes and things like that? How does that work? So we are taking a laundry man with us. <laughs> <laughs> His name is Nabinandan Das. Um... <laughs> oh, guys. <laughs> Last year, what we found was we, we did our own washing. Like, you know, yes. uh, we did it at night or something. Uh, if if you stay there, say, a couple of nights, you, you get there in the evening, you, you wash your clothes. And you, um, again, you know, uh, part of the um, items on the list is uh, um, a clothes line, which we, you know, I advise people to take with them from here. Okay. So you just put that, that clothes line or if there's a line up there, you know, then you hang and overnight they get dry because it's so warm as well. Yeah. That's yeah. How, what we found. And some places, you know, where you're like two or three days if they have the Adobe, Adobe um, option, they do, and then you know you can use that. But again, that, that's a personal uh, choice. Yeah. Oh yes. So that's another thing. If you're getting your clothes washed, that's uh, obviously your expense. Um, now, Ayodhya, no problem. We're there four days, so mm. washing, no issue. Chitrakoot, we probably won't get a chance to wash. Same with uh, Prayag, Varanasi, and Gaya. So perhaps if we have five... Yeah, so I, I was thinking, you know, if you have five sets of clothes, uh, then, you know, that should be that should be okay from Ayodhya up to Gaya. Then I, when you get to Gaya, then you can wash again. Not Gaya, Mayapur. Right? I think even Gaya could be that two nights. One night. One night, one night. One night. Okay. yeah. Yeah. Anyway, so that that's what I had on on the on the list as well. You know, maybe five sets of clothes for you know per person, uh, so that that could keep you going without having to wash so often. Yeah, because I mean the thing is we are limited to the luggage Correct. allowance. Um, mm. Mm. That's true. Yeah. Okay. We won't need heavy clothing. Luggage. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Correct. True. yeah. I would keep one jumper though. Uh, just in case sometimes night or a shawl or something a shawl. Yeah. yeah mind you it's very easy to buy something there it's so cheap mm. so <clears throat> don't worry and we'll have wherever we go hopefully we should have enough time if you want to do some shopping local shopping mm -hmm. something you want to buy say Ayodhya we're there four days or three and a half days we probably have <clears throat> a bit of time for shopping mm. 
so that uh, anything missing, you can pick it up. Okay, thank you. So I we weren't going to, any, any other questions actually? Any, any other doubts? So Pitamba. Uh, <laughs> Lungi, oh yeah, <laughs> Lungi is fantastic. It is indeed. It is indeed. Um, anything else? Anyway, if there are any questions, just put them on the group, uh, and we're gonna have another session probably in four weeks. And I was gonna give you an idea of what sort of what we we discuss when we have another session. So I've done a little bit now, not too much. So we. In Delhi, we will be there six hours, and of course, uh, from London to Delhi is an uh, aeroplane. Um, ten yatris are on the Air India flight, which leaves. Uh, uh, one second, let me just mute. mute. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. So. I know which one you like. Okay. Um, which leaves London Heathrow Terminal 2 at uh, 1 p.m. So we advise everybody to come by 10. We'll try to meet in a group. We're going to book the seats beforehand. Mm -hmm. So we'll hopefully be all together. And um, we can check in together as well, if possible. Flight uh, reaches at 2 a.m. in the morning. And the next flight is at 10 a.m. So we've got a few hours. We'll be hanging around in um, Delhi Airport, which is quite comfortable. Two Yatris are coming by Virgin Airlines. That's uh, uh, Minu, you and uh, Pat. Yeah. And that leaves at in the 10.30 in the morning. So they will arrive a little early. Yeah, Just at before midnight. midnight. Yeah. So they're two hours before us. And these, we have this wonderful couple from South Africa. Uh, they are coming... Um, in the afternoon on the 4th. Yes, and they're going to be staying one night in Delhi. And, of course, we have Kalpana Ben and Suresh who are already going to be in Delhi. Uh, so they will come straight to the airport. So our plane to Yodhya, we're all together in one plane at uh, 10 a.m., on the 5th, the next day. So we'll spend a few hours in Delhi. Hopefully, it'll be a little comfortable. And possibly, um, if there's an opportunity to take a shower, we will try to do that. Okay. And then the idea is we're heading off to Ayodhya. Uh, so hour and 20 minute flight. By car, it would have been 11, 12 hours or 13 hours, perhaps. Somebody did say to us, why are you taking a plane? Just go by car. But I, I'm not very keen on such a long journey, especially after we've just had a long journey from London. So we just take a plane. We'll get to the hotel uh, or around about two-ish. We land at 12. Get there. The hotel is in the center of town. Very, very close. No, fairly close. About uh, maybe 500 Half meters. Yeah maybe a 10 minute walk to the Ram Mandir. We could have the, the, the Ayodhya town is quite old. There are a lot of new hotels, which are about seven or eight kilometers away from town. But our thinking is that who knows when we will again be able to go to Ayodhya. So I'd rather be in the center of town and be make most of the opportunity to have darshan of the Lord in the Ram Mandir, not just one day. Uh, I'm hoping that we every will day. be able to go every day, early morning for the first <laughs> Mangalati at, uh, I think it's five o'clock or six o'clock mm -hmm. and also in the evening. So we try to make the most of this uh, opportunity that we have. If we were staying six or seven kilometers away, it's just a lot harder to get into the center of town. They have lots of roadblocks. Uh, they have 
lots of small alleys. You can't actually necessarily move around so easily. So I am hope, hope everybody's have, okay with that. The standard of hotels is okay. Um, it's not going to be the best, but it's not going to be the worst. We've, we've, you won't believe the <laughs> amount of time we've, we've had to spend on trying to uh, narrow down on something. Narrow down <laughs> and actually pin somebody down because many hotels, because Ayodhya has become so popular, they've increased their rates to like 10,000 rupees a night for a very, you know, a dingy little room. And we weren't willing to accept that. Uh, but we wanted to stay near the Ram Mandir. So we think we found a reasonable place. Somebody's going to go and check it out. Uh, we have some uh, contacts there who are taxi people. And we'll pay them to go and check out these uh, places for us. So uh, any is that OK? Anybody objecting to this, <laughs> I suppose? You're welcome to object, by the way. I don't uh, take it personally. Mm -hmm. Is it close? It's close enough to walk to the Ram yes. Mandir? Yeah, okay. uh, ten minutes at yeah. the most. Unless, unless you are Bharti Ben and me, <laughs> we will probably need somebody to carry us. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we should be able to walk there. This is one of the advantages. But I've also heard that the complex is massive. Mm. So um, I think from entering the gate to to the actual um, darshan is it's it's a kilometer as well inside. Right, right. So we are allowed to wear shoes, are we not? Where to get the mandir, or we have to go bare feet? Yes. No, no, no. You can oh. take your shoes uh, up to a certain point, yeah. and then they will have a very good facility to uh, shoe stands. Shoe stands, yeah. yeah. We'll be fine. Both of us will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> but um, this uh, person who who's just been to Ayodhya, he's actually advised that try not to take anything in oh, yes. because even your phone and everything. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, you know, there's you have to go through the paloma of uh, you know depositing everything, and you know, um, there's a queue for that as well. So, you know, if if we can avoid that, uh, we we try and leave. Uh, all our valuables um, either in the traveler or in the hotel before we go in. They won't allow to take any pictures from the past experience, isn't correct. it? Correct, correct. Yeah. No, yeah. Even, uh, yeah, even your uh, eye watch, they take, they don't allow that, yeah. uh, which we found that last year as well. So when I went to the Vishwanath Mandir just now, Varnasi, in Varnasi, yeah. We gave our mobiles, no problem. Then I went back to the security to go back in. They said, no, not allowed the watch. So we put that in. Then I went back in. I had something else in my bead bag. It was um, a lock. He said, no, not allowed the lock. So I went back to security. Uh, and then we went back in. And they said, oh, Sam is a black man. We need a passport for him. Oh, my God. <laughs> So, so many uh, rules and regulations. So best to leave everything back um, and just, just go and have a nice version. And we'll do it a few times, so we'll learn a lot. And the funny thing with the Vishwanath Mandir, Kashi Vishwanath Mandir, I went, we went uh, again in the, mo uh, in the morning Early at morning. Uh, five o'clock mm -hmm. and nobody checked anything. We, could have, we didn't take anything, we could have brought everything. We could have brought our kitchen sink and they wouldn't have checked. <laughs> so <laughs> it's, it's very much hit and miss, yeah. Okay. So we have, I think, three and a half days. And we'll do a, a daily plan. And we want to visit the following places. The Ram Jamnabhumi Mandir, hopefully every day. Saryu Nadi, we're pretty close to that as well. The river, the holy river, where Lord Ramachandra used to bathe. And Bharat used to bathe there. Uh, Hanuman, Gahi Temple, Kanak Bhavan. There's so many temples there. Uh, there's also Valmiki Ashram. You haven't got that on the list. But it's a, called something else. I yeah, it's something else. So we will we will try to fit in all of these. Some of these places are a little far away. So we'll get a, a, the traveler to take us around all together. 
so that um, we also manage to visit these places which are uh, within within Ayodhya, but a little further away. Um, and then Chitrakut. Um, so this is, yeah, I think this is where I finish. I didn't get any further than that, or did I? So here is our first car journey, big big car journey. Generally, the most we will be in a car is six hours, and it's not going to be in one straight go. We will have a, a, a one or two breaks, and we'll have lunch uh, on the way, um, arriving at the hotel by four. And then there, Chitrakut is a phenomenal place. There's so many wonderful things to see there. Um, and there you go. It's so from Ayodhya to Chitrakut, it's about a six hour journey. And that's it. That's uh, where, and then we go to Payag. So that's where I stopped. So that's it. Now, uh, let me just let's just introduce this is Karuna Mai. Karuna Mai, do you want to just uh, introduce yourself to everybody? <laughs> she's muted okay she has not, not oh okay no, that's okay and also kaushali amaji are you there yes she is uh can you show yourself maji kaushalia or maybe she's just a little She might be a little tied up. Um, any any more questions? Any comments? Um, Rajesh, Premika, are you happy? Oh, you're muted. You're muted. Okay. Yes, Prabhu. One question. On the 15th of August is Independence Day in Bharat. Yes. Any special thing that you have planned for us? Yes, uh, we were talking about yes. that today. Uh, let's where just, are we? Yeah, let's just check where we are. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Now, we were we actually were talking about that. Uh, let me just check again. I can't remember where we were now. Fifteenth August, we are. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's right. We are actually in Gaia. In Gaia, and mm -hmm. we're taking a train at at to night. Kolkata at night. So we're in Gaia. All day on, in Gaia. On that day. So we uh, in the morning we'll do the um uh, um the Vish we'll visit the Vishnu Path Mandir, and do the yeah. Pindan for whoever wants to do that, and then the mm -hmm. afternoon we'll go to both Gaia. So mm -hmm. I think. Uh, um hopefully we won't get disturbed by any celebrations or anything like that yeah. uh i think there's the month we should be able to visit those mondays without any problems and do oh. whatever we need to yeah it should be okay. because the, they won't be closed as, as part of a yeah. holiday but even if we got into a procession where they were celebrating independence day yeah, you don't mind <laughs> Right. Yeah, because no. we do celebrate India Independence no. Day in Africa. Yes, it's no. a very important uh, holiday in my home. Um, oh, okay. so, oh, yes, yes. In Natal, with the whole yeah, with a tricolored uh, mitai and oh, wow. you know, yeah. yeah, it's something small. We keep it to ourselves, but we have something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, that's yeah, good. Much love to yeah, celebrate yeah. it. Yeah, that's correct. Yes, that's why. Yes, yeah. good, good. No, that's, that's good. No, I'm, I'm sure we'll uh, there'll be something going on, but. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, it won't disturb our plans either. Oh, okay. <laughs> but if you do find me, if you do find me running in a crowd and dancing with them, <laughs> apologies from now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll we leave you there. We'll send you a forwarding address. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> Uh, Nani Ben, anything from your side? No, I think we are okay. Yeah. Thank you. Kwati Ben? No, I think um, quite a lot here. 
to a lot to digest. A lot to There's digest. a lot to digest. Yeah. Well, obviously, we're having comfort breaks and things like that, which yes. is part Moving. of nature in a way. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah, yeah they're definitely. Yeah, they're yeah. definitely. And the, and the hotels, um, do they have, I mean, you're saying Western, you're... Western Loos, yes. Yeah. facilities, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we make sure of that. Yeah. Correct. Uh, they're, they're pretty good standards nowadays. Um <laughs> I think the hotels that we've got. Okay, thank you, Nani Man. Thank you, Hare Krishna. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, do they, do the hotels provide things like iron and cattle and things mm -hmm. like that? No, no, they don't. Some might have a cattle, but um, all no, depends. Unlikely, probably not. No, some people have mm. written the oh, thing okay. they have. Yeah, they yeah maybe, but I, I would assume. They will only give you a towel uh, and, and soap. And if you're lucky, you get a bed sheet. Okay, okay thank you. Hare Krishna Pitanda. He's joking. Uh, Some hotels give you a private massager. Um, <laughs> actually, one place we did go, there was a yeah, Ayurvedic massager in the south of India. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So but no, there they won't be. I don't think. Yeah. Shall we just take the sleeping bag? Ah, good it. question. Good. Question. Yeah, I I always do. Good question. <laughs> because okay. I or or you know uh, my own sheet and because I I always feel comfortable with my own things. <laughs> mm, good question. Oh. Mm -hmm. Now sleeping bag might be a little too too much heavy. because yeah mm. yeah. Uh, but they do have. Um, what do they call those liners, sleeping Line, bag liners, sleeping bag liner. That right, I was only pulling your leg. I was no, I'm not. I'm serious. <laughs> no, I, I I have traveled with sleeping bag, especially like in the trains and everything. I use my own sleeping bag. Okay. I never used to, <laughs> but this last trip I did a uh, sleeper class journey from Delhi to Ahmedabad. I've never gone sleeper class. It's the, it's really hard, <laughs> but I thought, let me try it. I'm on my own. Let me try it. So there, luckily I had the liner bag and I used it and I really liked it. So I just keep using that now. Um, even in the hotel rooms, I just keep using that. So if you do want to, because I, most hotels will be very clean. Um, and if they're not, we would make them change the sheets. So it's not going to be an issue. In the trains, you'll also get this, you know. The, but the bedding is Bedding is clean. provided. It's quite clean. Mm -hmm. But, you know, if you are susceptible to allergies or, you know, skin uh, reactions, bring bring a sheet. Bring your sheet. Yeah. Thank you. Good one. <laughs> Any, Nina, mm. from your side. Mm, okay, yeah. mm. Sleeper bag sheet. Uh, Pat, anything you want to ask? Um, I think um, I've asked uh, the questions I wanted to. Okay. Thank you. No, that's fine. Neelam? You, yeah, you're... can we bring our kettle or not? Can yes. we bring our... Yes. Yeah, yes, yeah yes, you yes, can. Yes. Of course you can. Yeah. Yes, I mean, we've got a very small portable one. Yeah, yeah. How about the travel one? Okay. Yeah, the travel, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You're happy. Yeah, welcome to bring. Sorry, yeah. what was the question? What was the question? Kettle. Bring our own kettle with us. And I, I remember in Mayapura we didn't get towel. So do you think we didn't? No, we will. Towel. We will. We, we have got them. Uh, every time that we've gone, sometimes you know you just have to push them a little bit, but mm. but well, depends which, which. Where did you stay? Because you we're stay? staying in the conch building. Oh, no, in the in the I can't remember the name, but it was very big room as uh, Navita who said. Uh -huh. It was very big room, twin double bed, and uh, so everything was there, but uh, towel was not there. No, no, yeah, it, it should. They they should provide. They should provide. They yeah. do. They do. Yeah. And um, yeah. I I've been traveling to India, and so recently I went, 
So the sheets and things, they are very clean. They are uh, mm. everywhere. Um, but it was it was all right. I just came back from India. Okay. So they are they are clean. You know, so I don't have any problem with that. Good. Yeah. 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 Uh, I also lock my valuables in the bag. Correct. Yeah, that's what we advise everyone to do. Yeah. Yeah. And it's safe because you know, so I did not We're lose any, anything like that. Yeah. Uh, our phone or anything. I I never lose most of. Yeah. Good. And they were, they were not very big hotel. I'm saying it's a very small hotel as well as they were. Yeah. Three star, four stars, and uh, it was all right. <laughs> mm. Um, yeah. Okay, good. Good. Uh, one thing you might, um, especially if you haven't been before, you need the, the adapter as well. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Adapter. Which is again, I'm going to have it on the list, but uh, yeah. just bear mm -hmm. that in mind as well. Oh, mm -hmm. Yeah, this. I'm going to take this one. I mm. yeah, know. Uh, it's the same as European uh, adapter. It's uh, yeah. same as yeah. two pin. Yeah. Yeah. Kamalakshi, anything from your side? She's fallen asleep. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. okay. So about four weeks' time, if that's okay with everybody, we'll do another session with all the different towns where we want to go, what we want to do, so that everybody gets an idea before we go there, what we're going to do. Yeah. We can do our own yeah. research as well. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah, and anyone, you know, if any questions arise after this meeting, just put them on the group. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank, Thank you so you much. So. We'll put the Thank you. Group. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you too. Hare Krishna. Thank you. Thanks very much. Thanks very much, Mari Prabhu Jayanti. And everyone, nice seeing you, meeting you. And thank you, Pan. Thank you, Pan. Kamalakshi. Thank you for watching. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Going to be together for a month, almost a month, with my family. <laughs> we will, yes, it'll be nice. Yeah, yeah for month. Mm -hmm. And you it's your first time, huh? Yeah. To Bharat? Yes, it's our first trip. The South Africans, we are with our first trip. Wow. With kids and things like that. I think so. It's it's I think it's the mercy of Lord Narsing Dev. You know, he invited yes. us. Please it comes to me in Mayapur. I'm extending the invitation. <laughs> and when I when the installation of Ram Lala was in Ayodhya, I had this overwhelming desire. Good. You know, I had this overwhelming desire to just, you know, go to Bharat. You know? Because usually with me and Bharat is like, oh no, do I have to go there? There's a billion people, <laughs> round, round people. <laughs> you know? And uh, like, I would always like, you know, let us, let me, let me see how long I can string this, you know, like not to go, to avoid. <laughs> so finally, when Lord Narasim Dev did come to my ashram, I think my heart opened up. Mm. And uh, I had this overwhelming desire to see Ram Lala, mm. you know, mm. and then that's where it came. And then not long after that, there was this message on the WhatsApp group about mm. this, you know, <laughs> and then I said, oh, Krishna, I'm so, so happy. You know what? You know, you really, really, you know, come through for me. <laughs> nice. Yeah. It, it, it will be. Yeah. Uh, and, and then also you'll see the new Nishinga temple in my yes. Oh my yes and that's what when i prayed to lord nursing he told me that i invited you to come see me there <laughs> you worship me so often come and see me there but he always like with lord nursing he, he always tells me oh. i left it to you you know when in in our prayer when we do converse you know yeah. the conversations that we have when he tells you something it's so beautiful you know oh, 
Nice. Uh, yeah, and even some of the problems that I have, and I go, he sometimes he's he's, he's quite strict. He tells me, um, you know, <laughs> uh, you know that is your doing. You did wrong. You yeah. you need to call you. It's normal. Oh no, you're the best devotee. Or oh, this no no no. In your prayer, you in your prayer and through your heart, you you get that uh, that that so called scolding that Guru Maharaj would give you. You know, that to put you in the right track. It's not uh, just you know. Um, uh, when you have a relationship with the Lord, it's just not oh, you know, all roses and mm. it, it gets hard. It does get hard. It does. It does. And I I do spend a lot of time in at home with Lord Narasimha. Okay, a okay. lot of time. Yes. <laughs> so I don't know. Uh, going to Bharat, my separation anxiety. Um, mm. I don't know how I'm going to manage, oh. but I I guess I guess I have you all to help me through it. Well, bring a, obviously yes. bring a picture, and every day yes. you can do your seva, yes. Yes. manasi, which is much more powerful okay. even than the physical. Right, right, right. Or you can do that some same seva that you do yes. in the mind. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Because even if we go out, two days is too much. <laughs> uh, anyway, out of the house, uh, you know that anxiety, separation, anxiety. Mm. Yes. Anything One day we have to leave the material world, so we have oh, to. True. True. Yeah. true. Yeah. You know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> but at some point, you know, everything gets left behind. Even the deed oh. of the Lord gets mm -hmm. left behind. Only thing left is actually our karma, the holy name, and mm -hmm. Lord's, uh, mercy. You know, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. be carrying us through. So, yes. Yeah. But this, this, that's why I also feel this Ratya would be so nice to see a different perspective, mm -hmm. to see different views, to see, to learn mm -hmm. part of our spiritual education. Because mm -hmm. sometimes, you know, we do get uh, caught in a rut kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, know? everybody does. This is what we do. Yeah, we yeah. do. <laughs> and then mentally we have a block because we feel we're chanting, because we feel we are doing our arts at home. And we're reading, then we feel like, you know what, it's enough, it's okay. Mm. We get comfortable. You're right. Yes. Mm. Yeah. And, that's and, and I think that, <laughs> yeah, and that's what happens with me. I get very comfortable where I just don't want to move. Mm. Yeah. Know, I understand. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now we have to stretch ourselves. I mean, the Lord, my goodness, He's really making us stretch like anything. <laughs> there's no peace, there's no calm. <laughs> it's just, it's in His yeah. service. It's just madness. You yeah. know, so much to do and there's so much you know we want to do but there's so many roadblocks you know and the, but the guru Maharaj taught us never give up yes yeah uh, we've we, so far we have not given up so mm -hmm. many opportunities but we never give up <laughs> we must must take this opportunity thank you so much for this opportunity Thank you. And for I'm, I'm so excited to see Lord Narasim <laughs> Dev. I'm so excited to ah. see the Ram Mandir. Yes. Everything. Yes, all all the things. I'm I'm just truly, truly blessed. Nice. And be. I'm so excited. We're going to be a family for one whole month. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. The good thing is the good thing about Ragukul and Papa Nash, we're not lazy people. Yeah. We yeah. know how to good. we know how to cook. We know how to <laughs> Oh really? What do what do you cook? What's uh what's Anything, in my, everything. Uh, everything, everything, everything. The only thing I don't like too much is Chinese cuisine. I don't yeah, like yeah. it too much. Yeah. All the umami things and the sweet, yeah. sour, and all that. Yeah. No, no, not for me. Not for really, me. Really, yeah, I agree. Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, Italian, I'm good. I do make a very good Indian style pizza. <laughs> and I'm very, very good at biryani. Okay. <laughs> I'm very good at biryani. Do. Oh, no, you can't do it. Yeah. No, you can't do it. <laughs> Because uh, we were just thinking about that um, uh, a meal we reach, but they're already in Delhi. Mm. It's too late. No, it's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> no, it's fine. And I do, and I and I know uh, I'm I'm very good with the oil, with ladoos. Years and years of practice. Mm. Good. Because I am a, like I am a certified, you know, housewife. <laughs> I've chosen that in my life. Most I tried the other. Most I tried the other avenues. Sorry. Right, right. Most important job. <laughs> My most job. I tried the other avenues, um, but for me, it didn't bring much happiness as being in my home with my kids. I tried going to work. I tried doing documents. I tried doing the accounting, but it just didn't, you know, work for me. As much as I wish I could 
be in the mainstream of going a nine to five job. No, I tried it out. It didn't, not for me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and, and I do have a lot of respect for women who do it, uh, mm. you know, and they still come home and see to the kids, homework, mm. prashadam, chanting. Oh, you know, it, it's, 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 it is difficult for women, you know, I have a lot of respect it, for them. Many jobs. Yeah, yeah many jobs yeah. at the same time. It's very true. Yes, yes, yes. Thank okay, so Prabhu, much. we have to Thank say you. goodbye. Okay. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna and Danyavar for all you've done for us. <laughs> Thank you, Bhati Ben. So, okay. Hare Krishna, Prabhu. Hare Krishna, Prabhuji. Raghu. Thank you so much. Huh? Hare Krishna. Yes. Hare Krishna, Prabhu. Thank you, Bhati Ben. Kamalakshi. Yes. Hare Krishna.